hello everybody boobos so what's up guys in this video we are going to be creating a progress bar using bootstrap bootstrap trap bootstrap trap so we are going to be using bootstrap and as you can see on my left hand side i have two files C which is CSS, one folder is CSS, and inside CSS there's bootstrap.mini.css, another one is bootstrap.mini.js. So that's what you have to include in your file here. We say link, and here we refer to the, it's in the folder called CSS, so you first mention the folder, then you mention the file name, it's bootstrap.mini dot css so when that's done you also write a script tag for for the js you say the source so where is the source it is in a folder called js and the file is called bootstrap dot mini dot js so that's all you need for the body this is all what you need for the body so I guess you are ready to go now to see if this is working I'm going to create some div and I'm going to give it a class of container so guys I will sh I'm going to leave a link in the description below so that you can download these two files from Bootstrap. You can either use a CDN. Let me show you what a CDN looks like from Bootstrap. So you can go to Bootstrap and copy this CDN or download the real file so that you can use it offline. Right now I'm offline. That's why I'm going to be using it this side. I'm not connected to the internet. So that's the use of the offline downloaders so i can't use this because i'm not online let's go back to our so i'm going to create this and i'm going to leave uh before we create this let me show you what it does what i'm trying to do i'll create h3 i'm going to call this progress bar sp's progress bar so when I load this, are you seeing that it has no margin? But when I put it, it has no margin and padding. But when I put it under div with the class of container, wrap this in a div. So when we save this, it, it should leave some margin on the left hand side so that shows that the bootstrap is working in your file or in your web page now let's create a progress bar so i'll create a div let me space this i'll create a div here and i'll give it a class of progress progress and inside this div I create another div and I'll I'll call I'll give this one a class of progress bar progress bar and to style it so you have to give it with this for it to display we shall style it by saying with it and I'm going to put this at 80% so you can put it at any level so it's just a UI user interface I'm going to write the text 80% let's save this and preview the browser and this is what we are having so this is how simple it is to create a progress bar using the bootstrap like a bootstrap online <laughs> offline so you cannot this one simplifies your css you will not go and write 
border radius you so bootstrap gives you that easiest route to take to create such a simple progress bar so you can add another class so make sure you include this class for it to display that progress bar shall add another class like progress bar striped save this are you seeing that let me zoom in so are you seeing those striped lines right now i don't think this class may work but if you add a class active these you will see these stripes moving just that i have not included some jquery cdn so it's offline but if you are online and you add this class active these stripes will be moving animating it to be like a real uploader so thanks for watching guys if you like the video go ahead subscribe to the channel and i'll see you in the next tutorials uh lastly before we end this video you can add some let me say bg success let's see are you seeing that you can easily change its color so this is success the other one was primary so you can go on in case it has failed to load you can put bg danger so it displays some red color i guess this tutorial has given you some basic knowledge on how you can simply create your progress bar using C bootstrap using your css so the <laughs> kind these kinds of stuff are for lazy programmers who just need to go straight through the code so thanks for watching guys once again i'll see you in the next tutorial if you learned something go ahead subscribe to the channel like the video share it on different social medias or stone code cipher i'm out peace